What's going on guys, Average Tech Guy here, and today we are back with more tutorials for your iPad Pro 11. And I wanted to start off by talking about the actual dock that's right down here. So the dock is an easy tool that's gonna allow you to keep all of your apps that you use most frequently right at your fingertips. Now, I had a lot of questions about how to put the apps down in the dock. We're gonna cover that and I'm gonna actually show you a few more tips that are gonna make your life a whole lot easier by using this Apple Dock. So stay tuned. So first off, let's actually talk about the dock itself and how to put your applications down in there. So let's say I have an app that I use a lot and I wanna put it in the dock I'm going to hold it down until it starts to wiggle. Now you can either do this, hold it down and make that come up and hit edit home screen. If you hit edit home screen, they all start to wiggle as well. So either holding it down until they wiggle or using the edit home screen that either one of those will work. Secondly, while they are wiggling, you just take the app that you want down there, pop it in the dock hit done and that app is now a mainstay in your dock. Now you see this little line that divides this area right here. Over here on this side are your recently opened apps. So I'm gonna put this back up here. Now let's check out our recently opened apps. So say I open up the clock and I don't want the clock open anymore. I do that but now the clock pops up down here. Say I open up Google Home and now I don't want Google Home open anymore. Google Home pops up down here. So now the recent apps that I had open are really easy to get to. But this does not happen on its own. You have to actually come into the settings, scroll until you see home screen and dock. And this is where you can change all of this at. You can even change your applications to where there are more on the screen and they're smaller or to where it's less on the screen and they're actually bigger. You can keep today view on and home screen, which I have all that on. You can actually show suggested and recent apps in dock and that's what I just showed you. So that has been it for the dock tutorial guys. If you wanna put your things in the dock, you can. It makes life a whole lot easier just because when you have these applications open, now if you just kinda of pull up from the bottom, the apps that you use most frequently and your most recent used apps will pop up right here over on the side. So this is gonna be part one. Uh, and if it does good, I will make more of these types of videos, but I'm going to rely on you guys uh, the subscribers, my YouTube family. I want you guys to let me know what you want to know about this device so I can put together some of the best videos to give you the best tutorials so you can make the best use of this device that you have right here, your iPad Pro 11. Also, if you have other models of iPads, I'll be doing tutorials on those as well, but it's basically going to be the same thing. So pretty much whatever I can show you on here, I can show you on there. So hopefully this is able to help someone out. Until next time, be sure and give me that thumbs up. Please subscribe. Average Tech Guy out. Peace.